Today, we're here to talk to you about renting. Are you tired of it yet? Do you feel like you'll never be ready to buy a home? You are not alone. Thousands of people feel the same way as you. But we have good news. It's not as hard as you think to buy a home. You don't need to be rich or have a fancy job. With a few simple steps, you can prepare yourself to buy a home. First, to buy a home, you must save money. Most loan programs require a down payment, but it's not necessarily the 20% down payment that everyone fears. There are some loan programs where all you need is 3.5% of your sales price to be able to get into a home. So if you target a $200,000 home, that's only $7,000. You'll also need money for closing costs, but there are ways around that. Sometimes you can ask for seller assistance or you can choose a lender paid closing cost loan. You may even be able to use gift funds for the down payment from a family member, but having some money saved is very important. I bet you're wondering how you could save money when you pay rent, utilities, and other daily costs of living expenses. Well, you can make small changes, cut back on certain expenses and spending habits, and put the money into a high yield savings account. Invest it if you can, it will grow even faster. But be consistent and dedicated to your savings and you'll get there faster than you think. Next, focus on your credit score. Fortunately, credit scores change monthly and any positive changes you make will reflect in the credit score faster than you think. Head over to annualcreditreport.com and get your free credit report. You get one free report from each bureau every single year. Look it over and see what you must fix. So ask yourself, do I have any late payments? If so, bring them current fast. This hurts your credit score the most. Next. Do I have over 30% of my credit lines outstanding? If so, pay your credit card balances down. Are there any collections or public records? Get with the agencies and set up a payment plan or a way to satisfy your debts. The faster you work to improve your credit score, the higher it will be when you're ready to take the plunge and buy a home. Once you've established your baseline, focus on what you can afford. Use a mortgage calculator to see what you can afford based on your current income and financial situation. If it's much less than you hoped, think about ways to improve your situation. Do you need to start a side hustle to bring in more money? Do you spend too much money and need to cut back so your debt to income ratio is within the parameters of most loan programs? The key is to start now. Even if you won't buy a home for a few years, the more money you save and the harder you work to improve your credit, the more options you'll have when you're ready to transition from renter to buyer. If you have any questions, be sure to contact your mortgage lender. They can help you get ready to achieve the American dream, owning a home. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you found it helpful and I hope you would like to discuss it further. So if you would, please feel free to call me, Mitch Millat, Riviera Financial Mortgage, 424-290-8294. You can also email me, Mitch at rivierafinancial.com. You can also find me on Instagram at Mitchell Millette or on my Facebook homepage, Mitch Millette, Riviera Financial, Beverly Hills. Thank you so much. Look forward to talking to you soon and wishing you much, much success in the future.